Hi there, my name is Neil Clayton, I'm the author of I Show You Studio, and I'm going to give you a demo of what it can do. I Show You Studio is an app for creating screencasts. In other words, an app that lets you record your screen and then edit that recording. Studio has a number of tools that will help you to draw attention to what is important. You can highlight areas using shapes, add arrows, and you can further explain concepts using text. All of these objects support various stroke and color properties, as well as reflections, blurs, and shadows. Visualizing what you were doing during the recording is simple. Studio can animate mouse clicks, can show or hide the cursor, and visualize key presses. And all of these are available on each screen object individually, so that you can mix and match options as necessary over the timeline. Key visualization is much like other text objects, and you can customize its appearance by changing background, etching, and color properties as you like. Need to remove mistakes? The timeline has trim controls on its left and right sides to remove footage from either the start or end of your project. There's also a full ripple delete region cut tool for chopping out entire sections. Changing the Z order is done by simply dragging an object on the timeline. And you can either drag around existing objects, or by holding shift, make objects flow around those that you are dragging. There are keyboard equivalents for this as well. Sanity saving pan zooms. Just drop in a pan zoom object, and then move and scale the scene to where you want it. And all of the animation is done for you. Like other objects in the timeline, pan zooms can be resized to run longer or shorter, and a pan zoom doesn't have to be symmetric. You can zoom in over one second, and out over three if you want, while at the same time having different zoom amounts for each point along that pan zoom. It's really powerful. Need to explain something? Drop in an audio freeze frame. I show you Studio will record on the fly, and it will insert the audio along with a frozen video frame uh, at the playhead position, and all in a single operation. Done. The list goes on. It's easy to add more video and or pictures or music. You can fade in and out any object. And you can change audio levels. Combined audio video movies, in other words, can also be split apart so that you can treat the video and audio as separate objects if you want. There is a recording timer, so if you want to record and capture footage while you're not around, you can do that too. And of course, you need to share your result. Studio has built-in exporters to create iPad and iPhone compatible video, and it can also export directly to both YouTube and Vimeo. So go check it out. There's a free trial version at shinywhitebox.com.